Welcome to the first instalment of using your CAS calculator for Year 11 Maths Methods. Today I'm going to show you some basics on how to get familiar with using your CAS calculator. The first idea is that we have pages here and we can add pages if we like uh, by file, insert, that file uh, insert and we can do page so we can do a calculator page or a graphs page or a geology page. so I'm just going to do another calculator page so there we have two pages that we can reference uh, regarding our maths calculator this is going to become handy later on the first thing we're going to do uh, is is define a uh, function. So here we have over here on our left of the screen a equals t squared minus 3t plus 4. We're going to define that and I can write define and you can see how the font changes when I do that. Define and it recognizes that it's going to define something. Or I can say menu, sorry must I can say I can click menu actions define. And we'll say a equals t squared minus 3t plus 4. And if we press enter, you can see that it's done. It's defined what the function is. So if we wanted to, um, let's say, differentiate this, I, could, I can uh, manipulate this function without having to type this in again. So I could say menu uh, calculus derivative and we're defining uh, the function with regards to t and we're defining the function a. So if we're differentiating this function a which is defined as this we get 2t minus 3. That's kind of cool because we can work out what our gradient is because this is our gradient function. We can work out what our gradient is by substituting a value in at this point. So there's a few uh, syntax or the way we write this that we have to learn and for differentiating we need to tell the computer that we're differentiating A and then we're going to substitute a value T in there. So when T or time equals 4, the gradient for this function is 5. So it's a positive gradient of 5. So this define will allow us to do a whole multitude of uh, tasks on this function. So I hope that makes sense. Define A equals or we could do define as this is more common Y equals 3X plus 4 and we're done. So we, once we define it it's in the computer for what Y is. So we could say we could in differentiate that if we wanted to. Calculus differentiate we're doing it regarding x now, we're differentiating y, and our differentiated function or the gradient function is a constant 3 because that gradient is always 3, therefore everywhere is always 3. I hope that helps.